<sighs> Look. Look. I know... <laughs> I know I've been... I know I've been slacking. But... We're not slacking no more. Instead of slacking, we're back. In... We're back, baby. This is, uh... This is the level where I left off, right? This is somewhere in episode two. I can't remember. It's been... It's been so long. Fuck. What do I even talk about, man? I didn't come prepared. Oh, oh, I got some, oh, I got some stuff to talk about, baby. <laughs> oh, this looks familiar. Yeah, I remember what level this is. I got a couple topics to talk about that happened recently. One, Pro Jared. <laughs> I'll just give you a little teaser. I'll make you wait until I talk about Pro Jared. For now, you just get the little teaser. The second topic I want to talk about is more reasons why Detective Pikachu is the greatest movie of all time. Oh, uh, that's all I can think of for now. For, first, we'll talk about Detective Pikachu uh, and the reasons why why Detective Pikachu would appeal to me so much. You know, um, I don't think the movie was made for diehard. Pikachu fan. I mean, obviously it was, because they put so much detail and dedication into all the tiny little references that would make it... Does this wall fucking hurt you? The wall, the wall is evil. The wall hurts you. I think I said that last time I played this. <laughs> it always catches me by surprise. Anyways, it is... It is it's, it's got details that only hardcore fans would really notice if they keep an eye out. But... It's also made to appeal to uh, maybe millennials who who played Pokemon Red and Blue back in the 90s and 2000s. Maybe maybe you played you know Heart and Gold and Soul Silver. Personally, I didn't. My only my only uh, exposure to Pokemon was when I, I played Pokemon Sapphire in middle school, <laughs> and I didn't get I didn't even get that far. Yeah, uh, but. It's made. It's made for someone of my, of my. Uh, I'm the target demographic, because I don't know that much about Pokemon. But the, the you know the, the movie doesn't say, uh, oh he's a he's a dragon type. He's weak to steel, or uh, he's a it's a ghost type. So you need to use normal normal type moves. Don't do anything. So you got to do this specific move, and uh, your speed stats not so high. So be be careful about that. I mean, at one point, you get, um, what's his name? Justice Smith? What, what's his character? I can't remember the name of, of his character. It was like, uh, fuck, I can't remember. The, 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 the dad's name. What's the dad's name? Harry. Yeah, the dad's name is Harry. And, and Pikachu's like, hey, kid, if we want to find your pops, you got to stick with me. I can't remember Justice Smith's character, unfortunately. Oh, fuck off. But, uh, what, what, what was I going on about? Please excuse my, uh, dear Aunt Sally. Please excuse my bad, my bad memory. Oh, yeah, Detective Pikachu. Oh, fuck. This big meatball monster. Oh, there's two of them. There's two of them. Oh, sorry. I got a little excited. What was I talking about? Pokemon, right. Stop interrupting me, God. Pokemon, Justice Smith. At one point in the movie, he says, okay, you know, Volt Tackle, and you know, and you know, uh, what? oh, hey, look, I found the exit. That didn't take long. <laughs> I, I skipped a lot of the level. Save. Uh, that was the point in the movie where I, I got kind of... Oh, fuck! Don't do that! Don't automatically switch to the next weapon that I pick up! Jesus Christ! Ah. You, you know Volt Tackle? And you know, you know Steel Sprint? I don't know. 
And that was the part in the movie where uh, I want I watched it with my dad, and I feel like my dad <laughs> it kind of kind of zoned out at that point. But that's the only part where it gets technical. Where it goes into like the, the actual game. <gasps> Berserker pack, baby. Let's go punch these these assholes. Alright. Oh, I remember this fucking level. You go through here. Yeah, I remember. Remember the 90s? I, I, I remember. Remember the... Remember... Oh, shit. da 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 Fuck, I gotta look up the lyrics to that song. <laughs> uh, re rejected ready player one theme. This is such a bad video. Rejected theme song from ready player one. <laughs> yeah. Genius.com, baby. Oh my god, what's this guy's last name? Demi Adjuigibi? Change your name, dude. Remember King Kong? Remember Ferris Bueller? Remember War Games? And Back to the Future? Remember Tomb Raider? Remember Weird Science? Remember Battletoad and the Iron Giant? Remember Star Wars? The Transformers? The movie? Remember Ghostbusters? Remember the Goonies? Remember when Neon used to be trendy? Remember Where's the Beef Lady from Wendy's? Ready, player one! Oh my god, that's go! That scared me. Where do we go? Where's the where's the door at? Right here. Ah! Oh my god! I'm lost. Ah! Stop! Oh no! Where's the exit at? Where did I come from? Stop! Oh my god! Relentless! Get me out of here! I'm stuck! Oh my god! There's the specters in here now. Oh my god! I'm dead. I'm gonna die. There's a there's a baron of hell in here. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck between two pinkies. Oh my god! Oh my god! We're doomed. How did I make it out of that alive? Holy shit! Don't count your chickens before they hatch, buddy. Ah. Oh. 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 oh, we're not out of the woods just yet. Oh my god, this must be this must be horrible to watch. Die. Die. What the fuck was I talking about? Detective Pikachu. I thought it was just gonna be uh Oh! I thought it was Oh stop! I thought it was just gonna be, hey, remember Generation 1 of Pokemon? Remember Generation 1? Only 90s kids remember that. But no, I think it was a good, oh. I think it was a good, faithful, respectful to my intelligence kind of movie. Where do you go? There you go, asshole. How do I get out of here? Why am I using this? <laughs> There's inspectors. How do I get out? I can't remember how I got in. Just press random buttons until something good happens. Usually that's not how it works in this game. You press random buttons and monsters show up. How am I still alive? God, that was intense. Oh! Oh, I already, I, already, I, already, I already have it. Die. Why am I wasting my ammo on these fuckboys? Oh, come on! Oh, let me take a, let me take a breather. God damn. Remember, remember Akira? That's from Japan. Remember Galaga and Mrs. Pac-Man? Remember Contra? Remem remember Street Fighter? Remember the A-Team? Remember Knight Rider? Remember The Simpsons Season 1 through 9? Remember logging on to America Online? Remember Highlander and Highlander 2? Remember Star Trek? We certainly do. <laughs> Ready, fire on. <sighs> Fuck. This... This commentary just got completely derailed. 
so for today's topics, we're going to talk about Pro Jared. That's just a little teaser. And then we're going to talk about... Re enough about Detective Pikachu. God, I talked enough about that two episodes ago. It's over, dude. Talk about something else. <laughs> I, I don't have any more material for Detective Pikachu. I'm done. I'm never going to talk about it again. Let's talk about Pro Jared, because that's probably the only reason why you're still <laughs> watching. <laughs> he laughs at his own jokes. He's so eccentric. <laughs> so, uh... How about that Pro Jared, huh? Alright, alright. Raise your hands if you hopped onto the Pro Jared hate cancel ba bandwagon. Oh, oh, honey, he cheated on his wife on, on Twitter. I'm, honey, I'm, I'm gonna clap back. Oh my god, he cheated on his wife and he sends nudes to, to, to fans and he, and he, shut up. I bet half of the people who jumped on the Pro Jared hate train have never even seen his videos before. I've been watching him since like, maybe 2013? Like a long time ago. 2013 is a long time ago. It may not, may not sound like it, but it's longer, longer than you think. It's longer than you think. And I know, I know, he wouldn't, he wouldn't do those nasty things. Ooh, just in the nick of time. I, I wasn't going to jump on the hate wagon and say, Oh my god, you are such a clown. This is such a bruh moment. Clown emoji. Clown emoji. Let's spam him with clown memes from Reddit. Hey, Redditors, let's let's ruin the, this Reddit page. Dude. This, th th this all just goes to show how much of a fucking shit show, how much of a zoo social media is. You are all animals. You all act like fucking animals. And you deserve to be treated like animals. Oh, I'm so fucked. And, and you deserve to be treated like animals. I'm really running out of ammo here. The, f the fucking shitty memes. Clown. Clown. What a clown. Dude, this dude is such a clown. Well... Looks like there's only one way left out of this one. Die! Let's hold down the button. Just hold down the button and hope for the best! Woo! Let's get out of here! Okay. Fuck. How do I get out? Well, we're gonna be looking for the exit for the next five minutes. Here we go. Is this the exit? <laughs> Let's take another breather. Oh, oh, hey, this episode is sponsored, not really, by Perrier. Crack open a cold fucking Perrier, dude. God, that's good. I love Perrier. Uh, Perrier is not a joke. This stuff is actually great. And you owe it to yourself. Unless you are one of those fucks that jumped on the fucking bandwagon with the, the shitty Zoomer memes. Clown. What a clown. This is a bruh moment. And, and, then, and then three months later, everyone's like, Oh, I'm so sorry. Uh, I'm so sorry. I was so stupid. And then you look you look through the, the comments and you see all the people saying, What a clown bruh moment. And then you got all the replies saying, Uh, no, you're breathtaking. 
Replace breathtaking with clown. <laughs> ah! So pro Jared fucking clapped back at the zoomers. Take that. I'm so hopped up on goofballs right now. He clapped back. Unbelievable. And he came back stronger than ever. Ugh! I have 16 rock. I'm not gonna use my rockets. I, I probably shouldn't even be using my shotgun. I wanna save up uh -oh. as much ammo as possible. Ah! Be gone! <laughs> so everyone who left clown memes in the comments who's the clown now buddy don't believe everything you hear on the internet just just cuz some uh, just cuz some psychotic amnesiac came out on Twitter and said Bro Jared raped me! Now donate to me on PayPal! Ah! <laughs> I shouldn't be screaming so much. That doesn't make for good commentary. It's just annoying. Why are these guys so hard to kill? Die! This is such a satisfying weapon. Maybe I'll use it for the rest of the, the level. Who's the clown now, buddy? Some psychotic amnesiac just comes out and makes up some fake ass story about Pro Jared and then expects people to donate to him. Her. Some fucking psychotic tranny. Whatever. <laughs> what I don't like are psycho <laughs> psychosexual sadists that slay people. <laughs> <laughs> Those are the kinds of- Yeah, I'm okay with trans people, but what I'm not okay with is psychosexual sadists that slay people. <laughs> like, like, uh, like the guy that came up with the fake story on Twitter. And he fucking wanted donations? God, how can you be such a shitty person to make up some fucking fake-ass accusation about someone and then have the gall have the gall to ask for donations. Ooh, spy goggles. Dude, I got the VR headset. Now let's look for this yellow key. He fucking asked for donations. What a shitty person. But that's social media for you. In social, in, on Twitter, people just say whatever the fuck they want. They don't care if, it, if they look like if it makes them look like an idiot. And on Reddit, everyone, it's just a fucking popularity contest. Everyone's like, look at me, I made, I made this thing on accident, but it came out really great. Yeah, right, kid. Yeah, right. R slash that happened, R slash whoosh. Get real, kid. I have no idea where I am. Fucking Twitter, man. Oh, hell no. Nah. Donald Trump just says some racist ass shit on Twitter. Girl, you know I clap back at his racist ass. His racist, white supremacist ass. Girl, you know I clap back at him when he says some racist, white supremacist bullshit. You know I'm gonna clap back at him, sister. That's not, that's not going in the video. That's not going in the video. That's gonna get someone. That's gonna get someone banned. And that someone is me. <gasps> oh, you asshole. You are a certified asshole, you know that? Come pick up your award. For the biggest asshole on earth. You're second place and I'm first place. Uh, you're, you're first place, but I'm second place. That joke was not funny at all. Oh, 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 I wrote some jokes. Oh, no, I, no, I didn't write them down on paper. Fuck, I'm not going to be able to find them. 
Oh, shit. I wrote down some jokes. But uh, no, I can't remember them. I don't think I wrote them down somewhere where I can find them again. I, I just probably sent them to some. So. some Perrier. I need some Perrier after that one. Psychosexual sadists that slay people. And they have a fucking Tumblr where they just post <laughs> Game Grumps gay porn. Wow. Wow, kid. Who the fuck tr trusts... I can't even play the game while I'm talking about this because I have to move my hands like I'm in some kind of Italian. I have to move my hands while I talk. So I have to pause the game to talk about this. Why would you believe the first, like, where you, I can't even express myself because I'm just boiling over, dude. <sighs> Calm down. Get this out one word at a time. Calm down. <sighs> okay. So someone comes out and says, Pro Jared sent them nudes while they were 16. Okay. Uh, do you have any proof? Uh, no. So first, they don't have any proof. And second, they have a Tumblr where they, where they post, where they post Game Grumps gay porn. They're, and they seemingly just beg for attention from Game Grumps. Um, they also have they also pinned a link to their PayPal, and they asked for donations. So, why would you trust this person? All of you fucking people who jumped on the Pro Jared's a pedophile bandwagon, why would you trust this person? I swear to God, you people don't think, you people don't, don't think further than three feet in front of you. It would have taken, you, you could have just gone onto their, their profile and you would have seen they have a pinned tweet to their, their, their PayPal. That's a fucking red flag, dude. And you believe this person? You trust? You trust this person with accusations that could ruin someone's career. And they have a history of begging for attention from e-celebrities. And yet, some of you were stupid enough to actually believe this person. I'm having a hard time believing that. What is that button open? Does that button do anything? Did I just get duped? <gasps> it's a trap! I knew it! <laughs> gotcha! Oh! It's more where that came from, bitch. Yeah, I'm not touching that. That's a crime scene. I'm not gonna touch an active crime scene. What are you, crazy? Alright, man up. Man up, you pussy. Just grab it and go. I mean, I only need the partial in invisibility. I, I already have full armor. I knew it! I knew it! Die! Oh my god, there's a caco demon in there? There you are. Die. And... Also, the, all the people who, who believed, who believed in Heidi. Heidi is just another one of these uh, attention-seeking e whores on on Twitter, just begging for attention 
from from, from strangers. He abused me. Ooh, ooh, I'm a girl, so you have to believe me. I'm such a victim. I'm such a victim. This is just this is just further evidence that women have social privilege. I'm not an incel for saying that. Oh, you, you son of a bitch. Use the map, you idiot. I haven't been using the map. Maybe that's why I'm getting lost. Ugh! I think this is our way out. Oh, you son of a bitch. Die. This might be our way out. There we go! Yeah! Oh, we should go back to the beginning. There might be a secret. This could be the BFG, dude. I don't actually know where the BFG is. I know you get the BFG somewhere near the end. Because that's... That's how you cheese the spider mastermind. Watch me get ambushed. Yeah, yeah, I called it. I called it. Predictable. I could just take these guys out with my fists. These guys are weak. Ugh! Get out of here, you son of a bitch. I'm such a victim. Now donate to me so I can buy more clothes. <laughs> Women, am I right? <laughs> Women. <laughs> Women. Ooh, that's a doozy. Oh, there's so many areas in here I still haven't explored yet. It's such a fucking maze. Where are you? Where are you going? Die already. <sighs> what was I talking about? Donate money to me so I can buy more estrogen to inject into my asshole. Get real. Should I even bother killing this guy? Or should I just go straight for the exit? Uh, it wouldn't hurt. I like the sound those guys make. Whoa, save your rockets. <coughs> they don't grow on trees. Oh my god, just get out of here. Get out of town! Get on my face! I'm Chinese! <gasps> it's the really real exit. Yeah! Oh, clicked out of the window. Oh, I got 66% of the secrets. Spawning vats. Is that all of you? That better be all of you. <sighs> what was I talking about? Oh. Oh, oh yeah. So all, all of you fucking clowns. Leaving leaving your shitty zoomer meat. Oh no 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 no. Enough about Pro Jared. We already talked enough about that. You you get the you get the gist of it. Next thing I want to talk about. This is another moment where I have to pause so, so I can talk with my hands. Creeper. Creeper. Oh, man. He said the thing. He said the thing. Hey, speaking of shitty Reddit memes. Creeper. Oh, man. Mm. I need to stop pausing. I really I need to finish episode two in this video. Um, creep oh, man. This is gonna be a long rant. <laughs> it all started when people started pretending to hate Minecraft. 
you know, if you just join a, a social group and you're like, oh, hey, do you guys have Minecraft? I, I made a private server. You guys want to join? And then they go, oh, Minecraft. Aren't you a little too old for that? Is that a kid's game? <laughs> I'm an intellectual. So I don't play Minecraft. I play intellectual games like No, no Man's Sky. And then years later, around sometime, sometime in 2018, look, I was, I was shilling Minecraft back when people were still pretending to hate it. That's how much of a Minecraft hipster I am. But then, but then it becomes cool to like Minecraft again. And then you get the shitty Zoom tubers. That's what I call Zoomer YouTubers. Then you get the shitty zoom tubers. Sweden by C418, but it's actually a lo-fi hip-hop song. Get, fuck off. Fuck off. Stop ruining my, my fucking, one of my favorite childhood games with your shitty lo-fi hip-hop. Let me teach you how to make a lo-fi hip-hop song. First thing you need is an electric guitar. Which I, I don't have right now, but first thing you need is, is an electric guitar. Now, just uh, uh, you know what? You don't even need an instrument. Just get a, a sample of someone else playing guitar, and make sure there's a lot of major seven chords, and just go. And now loop that for seventy bars, and then put the. No, that, that's not a lo-fi hip-hop. What the fuck does a lo-fi hip-hop beat sound like? It goes like... It goes like a... Something like that. I, 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 haven't, I haven't made a lo-fi hip-hop before. Now, if you go to my SoundCloud, you'll realize that that's a lie. SoundCloud.com slash Bergy hyphen the hyphen burger. Look, I was going I was going through a phase. But lo-fi hip hop is so fucking easy to make. It's a joke. Okay, take a, a sample from a jazz song and then put a, a low pass filter on it. And then get surrounded by pinkies. Put a low pass filter on it. And then put a vinyl crackle sound effect over it. And then just loop. And then put trap drums on it. And then loop that for 70 bars. And then you can put on some. You can throw in some emo lyrics. Just for extra flavor. And be like. Oh. And I'm so sad. And she. She ran off. And I. I'm alone. I do do do. I do 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 do. Uh, uh, uh. Oh hey look. See this uh sprite right here that sprite one of the frames of animation is from an unused enemy oh invulnerability oh oh i should first of all i should save because i'm on a new level second of all i should have grabbed that first so i could fist them all god i'm stupid you know what it's not too late it's not too late it's too late Apologize. It's too. Oh! Oh, that, I thought that was a cyber demon. <laughs> I was gonna get scared. Or it's episode two. They're not just gonna throw cyber demons at us. This isn't episode four where you just get a uh, twenty cyber demons every level. <laughs> this isn't Doom two. Roasted. Oh, blue key card. Let's let's go. What was I talking about? Creeper oh man. Oh, uh, your memes are stupid. Oh, yeah. So then it becomes popular to uh, to ironically like Minecraft again. Look at me. I like Minecraft. Only ironically for the memes. I don't actually like Minecraft. I don't want you to think I'm playing a kid's game. I'm really, I'm really insecure about what people think about me and the kind of games that I play. Uh, I don't play baby games. Uh, stop calling me a baby. Uh. Please. You have no balls. You have 
No balls. I was shilling Minecraft back when it was popular to hate it. So don't give me this. Sh you, don't give me your sh your Zoomer shit. God, I hate Zoomers and I hate Millennials and I hate Boomers too. I hate everyone. So then it becomes cool to like Minecraft again. What else? Uh, and then uh, Creeper. Oh man. First of all. I was singing that song before you were even born. I know all the lyrics. I know them from heart, dude. Because I was singing that song before you were even born, kid. Ah. Ah. <clears throat> I'm not going to sing the whole whole thing. Because I don't, I don't want you to think I'm one of these Reddit fags. But, 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 um, basically, what if, what if we put the lyrics to a, I, to a Minecraft song? Funny, 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 poopy, funny, ironic Minecraft. It's ironic. I'm so funny. What if we put the lyrics to a funny, ironic Minecraft song? Minecraft good Fortnite dad. What if we put the lyrics to a funny Minecraft song? And we, we put different fonts over it. Uh, what if I spammed my Discord furry RP group with Queeple? Oh, man. <laughs> I hate, I hate popular memes. I hate memes that get popular because they're the most repetitive, boring, unfunny shit. Creeper. Oh, man. Wow. You did it. You said the you said the line. Congratulations. Say the line, Bart. Creeper. Aw oh, man. <laughs> he said the line. Ugh. God. I'm so full of hate. <laughs> I started off so happy. I was laughing, but now I'm full of hate. What happened to me? So, um and then and then to make it worse okay this is how memes die this is how memes die um a politician quotes the meme pokemon go to the polls um a celebrity uses the meme on their tv show hi welcome to the ellen show damn daniel <laughs> <sighs> Or, when the original creator tries to milk all the meme potential out of it. Captain Sparkles. Hey, everybody. Captain Sparkles here. I don't know what he, what he, I don't know what he, what he says in his videos. <laughs> hey, everybody. Captain Sparkles here. Today, we're going to be looking at me meme review. I don't know. I've never seen a PewDiePie meme review video. I think, there's, I think he claps. I, I always see clap emojis. I don't know if he actually claps, though. Let's look at these creeper aw man memes. So we back in the club, got that body swinging from side to side. So, I mean, Captain Sparkles started milking the creeper aw man meme a long, long time ago. And somehow people are still fucking clinging to it. And I don't know why. It's so obviously fucking tired and dead. And yet, people are still clinging on to it. Because funny! Funny! Poopy! <laughs> oh my god, how long is this? How long have I been recording for? Fuck, I wanna- 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 I'm gonna- I'm gonna split this into two parts. So I can milk more content out of this. Yay!